What's up guys, happy Friday. Welcome friends, if you're here, check out that live chat. Say, hey, I'm here. Hey Natalie, guys, what's up? Welcome to Friday. We made it and it's gorgeous outside. Um, equipment today, guys, a set of dumbbells and we're gonna rock it and we'll get going in just a couple minutes. This timer is ready to go and we will go ahead and start talking about what we have going on today. All right, friends, we have got full body Friday today. Four parts, we have got heating up. We've got, um, I'm feeling myself. We have got our uh, quick little core burner over here and then our mystery finisher. I know you're all excited about that mystery finisher. What it gonna be? We don't know yet. All right guys, round one, heating up. Got three movements. We're gonna kind of go in a pyramid scheme. We're gonna start with uh, two pogo jumps into two like jump squats and a half burpee. I will so demonstrate this. Then up on our feet for some jumping jacks, down on our backs for some bicycle crunches, and just working our way backwards back to jumping jacks and those little pogo jumps with some squat reaches and a half burpee. What does it all mean? I will demonstrate for you right now, guys. If you guys are just joining us, grab your water, grab some dumbbells, set them off to the side. I'm going to demonstrate our movements for round one, heating up. Guys, our first movement, I wrote down two pogo jumps plus two reaches and a half burpee. Basically, we're gonna go hands behind it, right? We're gonna jump in place two times. One, two, we're gonna jump out and we're gonna reach down together, out, reach down, and then we're gonna go up. Then we're gonna jump down to a half burpee. I'm gonna turn to the side to demonstrate that. We're gonna go hands down, Feet, feet back, and then we start again. Full speed. And then we start again. Simple as that, guys. Movement two, jumping jacks. Movement three, bicycle crunches, and then we work our way backwards. Are we ready? Almost, is it 12.05? One more minute, guys. Grab your stuff, catch your breath. Let's get after it. All right, starting that music over. Here we go. All right, guys, I'm gonna hit that timer. We're gonna start 45 seconds on, 15 seconds of rest, five rounds, and then we're moving on. All right, guys, going in 10 seconds, starting with our pogo jumps, squats, and that half burpee. Here we go, three, two, one, let's go.
from yesterday. dumbbells and we're going to use them well. So we've got, I'm feeling myself, 
Round two, nine minutes, four movements, 30 on, 15 off. We're gonna start with a front squat with those dumbbells. We're gonna stand to a rotational press, alternating right side, left side. Next up, we've got two lunges. We're gonna go to a standing position, and we have four bicep curls. Movement three, we're gonna go four renegade rows, plus one push-up. You can have those hands on those dumbbells or take them off those dumbbells for that push-up or drop down to those knees. And then movement four is gonna change all three rounds. Round one, movement four is gonna be a Turkish getup with one side or one arm holding that dumbbell. So let's go right side. We come back around to that, back around to that, back around, when we come back around to that, yes, I said that right. We're gonna go Turkish get-ups on the left. And then movement three, for uh, or round three, that fourth movement will be athlete's choice, AC, any kind of get-ups you want. You can go Turkish get-up and alternate that dumbbell. You can go candlesticks. If you wanna drop down to a burpee or do any kind of birding get-up. Athlete's choice, fall down, get up, but it's 30 seconds. So one more time, guys. Front squats to some presses, lunges to some curls, renegade rows to our push-ups, and then we have our get-ups in a couple different fashions. Let me go ahead and demo those for you guys. All right, guys, movement number one. We're gonna go front squat, dumbbells up in that front row. We're gonna squat. As we stand, we're gonna rotate, press, and then other side. Movement number two. We're gonna go two lunges. You can go forwards or backwards. Let's say I go forwards. One, two, to a standing position. I have four bicep curls. Two, three, and four. Back and forth. We're gonna go down to the ground for some renegade rows. We have four alternating renegade rows. We've got one, two, three, four, followed by a push up. Feel free to drop down to those knees. If you need a scooch back without using those dumbbells, totally fine. We've got options. And then movement four for our first two rounds is gonna be a Turkish get up. We go on our backs. We're gonna start with that dumbbell up towards the ceiling. There we go. Opposite knee is raised of the uh, arm that's holding the dumbbell. We're gonna reach up, we're gonna put that hand behind us. Did I do this right? Did I do that right? No, same, same knee, same hand with that dumbbell. Wow, it's been a minute. Then we're gonna come up, put that hand behind us, sweep that straight leg behind us, then we'll go standing, and then just take it down, plant that hand, sweep the leg all the way back down. Full speed, well, fuller speed. And then the same thing will go for the left side. And then round three, totally up to you. Whether you wanna do Turkish get-ups, some candlesticks, you just wanna roll back. And stand up tall, totally fine. So you're gonna fall down, you're gonna get up. Athlete's choice for some get-ups. It's kind of a choppy demo, guys, I apologize. I got weekend on the brain, you feel me? All right, guys, let's do this. In 10 seconds, starting with our front squats to rotational press. Three, two, one, let's go. Changing direction is hard. Three, two, one, rest. Set those dumbbells down, shake it out. Whew, set my back down. All right, guys, two lunges, four bicep curls. Lunge in any direction you like. Three, two, one, here we go. Three, two, one, rest. 
Four renegade rows, one push up. Three, two, one. Here we go. Two, one, and rest. 
big rows and push up. Two, one, here we go.
and then same thing on the opposite side. All right, I rambled a little too much. What you saying? Options for days, guys. Sometimes I get ahead of myself and I forget, hey, we all different and we all beautiful, but we all gotta do some core work. I got you guys. And if anyone has any questions ever, use that live chat. I will do my best to be like, what you got? I got you. Sound good? All right, guys, a little four minutes of Ada. Toe touches, leg raises, or those rollouts. Single leg bicycle. Okay, we're good. I thought someone else said something. All right, guys, enough of me rambling. Let's go core work. Let's go toe touches. Remember that negative. Remember that two second negative. Two, one, here we go. Two, one, rest. All right, we've got those rollouts or leg raises or any of those options I gave you. Just keep those legs off of the ground. Two, one, let's go.
our final burn, but it's also our mystery finisher. I really got weakened on the brain, guys, let me tell you. All right, mystery time. All right, what I did write on the board though, I could just tell you, but it's gonna be a six minute Tabata to today. Yeah, oh yeah. We cut that core a little short, so our burner is gonna be uh, an extra minute or two. Sorry about it, it's Friday, let's do it. All right guys, as you know, I've written down every single movement, or at least like round one, movement one, or round two, movement three, on a little piece of paper. I'm gonna shuffle it, I'm gonna pick four movements. We're gonna do those four movements, three rounds, uh, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, excuse me. All right, sorry, not looking. All right, movement number one is round two, movement one, and that is our front squat to rotational press. So grab your dumbbells. And don't worry, I know we repeated those uh, pogo squats and jumping jacks in round one. I only wrote those down one time, so there's not gonna be any secret double whammies. That's just rude. All right, movement two. Round one, movement two, jumping jacks. Love it. So we have our front squats and presses, followed by jumping jacks, followed by movement, or round two, movement three, all our renegade rows and push-ups. So we got front squats and press, jumping jacks, renegade rows. Come on, give me a, give me a, I don't know, give me a toe touch. You know what, give me that app burpee. Mama wants a new pair of shoes. Although she has nowhere to wear those shoes because everywhere is closed. Okay, last movement. Round three, movement two. Oh, we got our rollouts. We got those leg raises again. Oh Lord, yeah, Natalie. All right guys, from start to finish, front squats and our rotational presses. Squat, press, squat, press. Next, jumping jacks. Ayo, jumping jacks. Uh, next, renegade rows and push-ups. Four renegade rows, one push-up, and then our lower abs, leg raises, roll outs, knee tucks in. I don't know, you want to hold a hollow body? That's all fine with me. Just pick a core movement. How about that? I won't be picky. I can't see you. I'm not judging you. Okay. So ready. So ready for the final bird. All right, guys, this is going to be six minutes. So starting with those front squats and presses, have your dumbbells handy. Front squats, presses, jumping jacks, renegade rows, and then our roll outs. And then we get a roll out. Three rounds, guys. All right, guys, we're here. Final burn. Let's go. Get ready. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Rotation. Don't do it. Just do some thrusters. A little front squat to a press. Take out that rotation. It's cool with me. Two, one, and rest. Dumbbells down, we're going jumping jacks. Right? Two, one, two, yeah. Three, two, one, let's go. Two, one, now rest. Renegade rows, push ups, let's go. Two, one, let's go. You can always do this movement without the dumbbells. Totally fine. You can just go a shoulder tap, or you can just pull that hand back like I'm doing without the dumbbell. Two, one, and rest. All right, dumbbells off to the side. Down to the ground for our rollouts. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Two, one, let's go lower abs. Two, one, rest. Up on our feet, quick 
transition to our front squats. Two, one, let's go. Three, two, one, rest. Dumbbells down, jumping jacks. Whew. Finish this, we're halfway done. Three, two, one, let's go. you guys. Oh, hey, Laura. Welcome, friend. Guys, happy Friday. That is all I have for you. So excited it's the weekend, and I'm so excited to see you guys a week from today. Gym is ready for next Friday, reopening. Hopefully, you'll all get some emails popping in your inboxes with all the details. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me. Bree, Josh, Mindy, Matt, whatever you guys want. But this has been a great time to get myself out of my comfort zone, to get you guys with me moving together, 
Monday through Friday. I've loved every second of it. I was definitely nervous at first, but I think you all can tell I got a little confidence in the step now, but I like to tell people, uh, long story short, COVID gave me confidence. Who knew? But I love you guys. This is tough, man. Man, I love you guys. The love and support is real. It's surreal. But gosh dang it, I love you guys. Thank you so much for joining me, guys. Don't have time to do the sugar wad challenge. Actually, run out to the gym and help with the blood jab. But you guys killed it today. I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys Monday for kind of our last virtual uh, week of me in my home working out with you guys. But don't worry, there's more to come. But thank you guys so much. As always, thank you for the love and support. We're getting back in that gym and we're getting after it. Let's do it. I love you guys so much. Have a great rest of your Friday.